how do you view leadership and how did you come into becoming a, a leader? So I got into it through HR. So my background is in HR. So I was already working with leaders. And and I and I almost fell into it because I thought, oh, actually, they, there's space for someone like me. Look, I, but I've been challenged with my own leadership because I did this um, years ago. I did this like personality thing. And I know this is an issue I have is I want to be liked. So let's just keep it very real. I have this problem, right? <laughs> Look at me exposing myself. <laughs> I'm just going to say it. Mm-hmm. So, but true leaders don't care whether they're liked or not. Mm-hmm. So I've battled, battled, battled with this. And I've noticed in my quest to be liked, I've not, um, I've not met my own personal and professional and financial goals as a leader. But if I was to stand up in my true leadership, irrespective of whether you like me or not, I will know that I'll meet my personal, professional and financial goals. Mm. So that's something I battled on. And sometimes... What's the battleground? The battleground is like, how, how can I be liked and be a true leader? Where, where that means sometimes you've got to stand up and say things that people don't like mm. and... That means you'll lose friends, you could lose followers, you could lose people that thought you were one thing. So I've I, I've struggled with that and I've got a mentor, so I'm not even going to lie, I've got a mentor who's working with me on that. Mm-hmm. But yeah, I could help other leaders do it. Mm-hmm. So, um, but I am now working on some projects, which is definitely exercising my leadership qualities. And I'm thinking, yeah, I can do this, I'm going to do this. And part of being a leader is standing out and putting your head above the parapet, mm-hmm. which means you might be thrown flowers and which means you might be thrown swords. Mm-hmm. So I that that's where I'm at. Sometimes I get flowers, sometimes I get swords. Mm-hmm. But either way, I'm here to do what I have to do because no one else is doing it. And that's mm-hmm. what a true leader is. 